Being thankful for what you have is one of the simplest and easiest ways to lift your mood. It can give you a motivational jolt. It can help you to live a happier life. So try making thankfulness a daily part of your life, no matter where you are in the world. Pause and look around. Yes, you look around. A simple step for being more thankful is to pause during your day and ask yourself two questions. What are three things I can be thankful for in my life today? Who are three persons I can be thankful for to have in my life and why? If you don't come up with three individuals or three things each day, then it's okay. One thing or one person is great just the same. But if you can, try not to repeat yourself too often. Instead, think of more people and things to be grateful for day by day and expand your thankful view of your world. Express your thankfulness. Don't just stop at coming up with people for whom you are grateful to have in your life. Take a few seconds to tell them about it. This will make their lives happier. And as their faces light up with a smile, you'll feel happier too. Now, that gratitude could just be a small sentence, but it can have a big impact on someone's day, week, or even life. So be sure to make the small effort to express it. Look towards yourself too. It's not only things and others that are important. You are important and valuable too. So... Appreciate that. Ask yourself, what are three things I can be thankful for about myself? It could be that you were a good sister or brother or friend during a crisis last week. It could be that you finally got done the things that were difficult and boring that you were procrastinating on. Tell yourself thank you. Your self-gratitude does not have to be all about your achievements you can simply be thankful for your good sense of humor or the help you give your friends or family or by just being a good listener from time to time and the thankfulness does not have to be about big things either it could simply be about the fact that you did some self-care this morning be thankful for the things you may take for granted the things we get very used to can become things we take for granted. But they are not things everyone in the world have access to. A few such things I like to reflect upon and be very thankful for are having a roof over my head and a warm home, having plenty of water to drink, that I don't go hungry, being able to enjoy small and free pleasures of life, the ability to access the internet so that I can learn and connect with people, I have found that to be grateful for, and especially during situations when I'm having a tough time. Start and end your day with thankfulness. To make thankfulness into a habit that sticks, find a regular time for your day to be thankful. For example, you can start your day by finding three things to be grateful for over breakfast. Or you can take a few minutes in the evening just before going to bed and use a journal to write down three things you were grateful for about your day. Most of all, thank Jesus. It is through him that we can move and breathe. As a matter of fact, he is our life giver. Have you thanked him recently for the wonderful things and even for those things that are not, not so wonderful in your life? We are reminded in 1 Thessalonians 5.18, In everything, give thanks. For this is the will of God concerning all of us. Give God thanks today. For your home, for your family, for your job, for your ability to, to do things, for your faculties being in place, for you not being ill. And even if you are ill, you are alive. Give God thanks. Then tell someone thanks. And most of all, be thankful for who you are. Have a thankful day.